Hey, what's up, everybody? My name is Trophinet, and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Uh, we're still at the entrance of the cauldron, uh, right here, and it appears there's another type of robot in here. So, a shell walker. He has a lightning gun. His body is strong to lightning, and he has a power generator on his back. So, I think might want to start this off with that. Let's go with the sharp shot bow and then... There we go, take that off. And just stay hidden over here. Just gonna stay hidden over here and stealth kill anything that comes closer. Because I only aggroed those three apparently. There's something attacking me! Oh shit, that everybody's interested. No, that was the wrong potion. That was the potion I wanted to take. Oh, wow. Yeah, he didn't give a fuck. Okay, so that went horribly wrong. Don't really know where those guys are right now. Because they were here a second ago, but apparently... They might have come from over there. So I'm gonna try and stealth kill pretty much everything in here. Just because I can. So this must yeah. be the cauldron Drow was talking about. So let's lure them in one at a time. And stealth kill each bad boy that comes too close. There we go. Could override the monster as well. The Ooh, that one saw something. Just gonna try and move a bit away from here. Oh wow. Okay, they also saw something. I could try and kill one of them, but that would probably set off everything else. I don't know if those other guys have entered already. No, it doesn't seem like they have. Once they start, yeah, okay, so they're starting to lose interest. Just gonna lure that one scrapper. Oh, that is not the scrapper I wanted to lure, but... Apparently that's the one I'm getting. So, watcher, please move forward. Don't think he saw anything. Ooh, that was, that was maybe in sight. Ooh, do 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 do. I once saw his buddy get killed, but apparently he doesn't. He didn't see me. Ooh, do do do. I think that went pretty smoothly. Now the only one left is that watcher over there, which I'm gonna murder in a second. There we go. Can kill that one with one hit, so. No fancy shell walkers nearby? Okay. Uh, so let's go inside. We've uh, wasted enough time at the entrance here already. Let's One just door. go inside. But how to open it? Overriding it, apparently. And there we go. Oh, wow. Hello. This looks awesome. Um, explore the cauldron indeed. Can I walk over this? Apparently I can. This looks awesome. Kind of reminds me of the, of Destiny. The, uh, the AI uh, room over there. Ooh, I need to rappel down. That is the most dangerous way to rappel ever. I know I kept, I keep saying that, but that's just freaking dangerous for no reason. Uh, ooh, what's that? What is this? Oh, that's a supply crate. A triangular supply crate. Anything else of interest? It seems like there is anything here. Let's head Metal. inside oh, right. of this. Ooh. It's like this entire place is part of some huge machine. But yeah, that's it? indeed what it looks like. Who made it indeed? Probably the old ones, or maybe they started making their own machines. Ooh. I want to drop down there. 
This is... Kind of reminds me of... Maybe even the Matrix. What's it for? Damaging a vent creates a stealth area. I don't think I need to make a stealth area, because I think I can just take this guy down. There we go. I want to check it out how that works, though. So if I just hit that thing, it... Oh, yeah, so it just releases a, a puff of smoke. And that just counts as the, the red grass works. So if I... Ooh, okay. Moving components around. I wonder where. So if I stay in here, yeah, okay, so now I'm invisible. But I'm pretty stealthy with this armor. There's medicinal stuff here. I think if I just... Yeah, there we go. And then I can just... Stay here. There we go. Wanted to do a stealth attack there, but apparently it didn't connect correctly. But yeah, these things are moving components around and they're still doing it, so... I'm supposing that these guys are not made by the the old ones, but they're just here for something else. Who made these robots? That's indeed the bigger question. And who is still making these robots? Because it seems like they're making new types continuously. Now we're outside again. Okay. Is this where we want to be, or...? It seems like we're going back up here. Oh no, never mind. Never mind, I said nothing. This keeps going. But they do like triangles, that's that's something at least. Um up the ladder, just climb up. I must say these ruins look a lot different than the outside world the world. I know I'm kind of Captain Obvious in here, but. This looks amazing. Shit, and it's dark in here. Okay, more... More plants. Hello? Anything I can check out? What's that? Oh, that's just a vent. Uh, okay, uh, the vent in this room, probably. Okay. Oh, what's that? Magnetic container reel. Maglev conveyance of an unknown design can support human weight. Oh. The thing near the gap. What does it do? Network up the link. Maybe overridden. Okay. Kinda looks like the f the head of a watcher. Oh, that just makes a bridge. Okay then. Thought there was going to be something else here, but apparently not. Thought I needed to jump on top of one of those. Uh, more supply crates, always handy. Hello? The lights are jumping on when I pass them, so there's some kind of detection system going on here that detects humans for some reason and turns the lights on if they pass. So these ruins might actually be from the old ones nonetheless then. Anything? You can go over there. Seems like a very fancy door over there. Probably the end of the the area here. So let's override this door as well. Kind of takes a while. But with our magic spear we can open any door from now on apparently. Let's just crouch just in case because I don't know what's in here. Doesn't seem like there's any robots in here. There is something... It looks like those flying machines move components around. Might be able to take me somewhere. Ooh. Can check this out as well. Another... Improving thingy. My medicine pouch is full. Okay then, so I need to jump on there probably. Yeah, okay. So the next one that comes by, I'm gonna try and jump on. And look at this rail. Oh! Yeah, there we go. Oh god, this was a bad idea. Why? 
So the cauldrons make machines. I don't know, do I need to drop off at some point? Can I drop off at any point? Whoa, this place is a lot bigger than I anticipated. Hello? Do I need to do anything? Jesus Christ. I'm just going. I am just going. Okay. Go to the cauldron core. Did we just get a tour of the entire level? <laughs> to then be dropped off at the end of it? This kind of looks like the container that Shellwalker was carrying around. Um, what happens if I... Ooh. Oh, there's watchers here. Didn't realize that. Can I jump on top of this? Yeah, okay. Doesn't really do anything. But yeah, so let's just jump and... Okay. What the hell? That was weird. I thought I could just jump over there, but apparently not. So I need to jump on top of one of those thingies. And that watcher is still stupidly looking at the other direction. And then I need to drop off over here, probably. Go. Check this out and then. What is that? That thing next to you? That's another one of those things I can scan, probably. Okay, so I do want to take these guys out stealthily, stealthily, stealthily. There we go. Next one. Ooh. The next one will be this one. And then I need to override this thing over here to make a bridge. Hopefully I can do that fast enough without the, the watcher spotting me. If he turns around, he turns around. I don't think he saw me. I don't think he saw me. I do love how they um, how they did the stealth, because in a lot of stealth games, if you jump, you exit stealth, but in this game, you can jump while in stealth, which is uh, very handy indeed. So, we made a bridge over there, but we can also go across, it seems. And I do want to check everything here. Oh! Okay, there we go. Don't know if that's gonna lead somewhere. Oh shit. There's a watcher that's already actively looking for me over there. Alright. Did anybody else see me? I don't think they did, because otherwise I would have been swarmed by now, probably. Nothing else here, it seems. Might as well move forward. Ooh, that is one of those. Yeah. That's one of those things that killed me. I was walking outside as well. So I do want to try this again. So I do want to do heavy damage to that thing on the back there. Because that removed it from its back. Although... Seems like the thing is moving away. Can I lure this guy? Yeah, okay, I can lure this guy over here. Gotta be careful though. He's coming this way. I'm just gonna try and override this one for once. So now he should be able to attack the ones over there and just gonna see how this pans out yeah they start attacking oh he actually killed them in one hit he's gonna attack the shell walker as well okay so they're attacking each other now they're just gonna keep attacking them oh ho ho 
And he's attacking the other ones. Yeah, and then he gets knocked down. And that was a big strike. Yeah. Just gonna lure... This one. And then maybe... Do I want to try and do the same thing? Because he's... They actually do a bit of damage. But I think there's only a few left, so I might as well just take them down. Because, yeah, there's one more Watcher left. I don't know if I can even lure that guy. I'm just going to tag them so I know where they are at all times. Without me having to check the, uh, the focus screen. Ooh, I do want to get... Nope, not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Can I check this thing on my turn? So, weakness. It can be shot off with probably the... The fancy ammo of the break shot. You might want to do that. Oh, shit. He's... In a very strange pattern. There we go. And that's gonna have to... I'm gonna have to go outside of its reach. I'm careful. I'm gonna go with the Terror Blast arrows now and try to take out its claws. Because those things do way too much damage. Just stay out of the way for now. Oh god, he's even stunned by that. Oh, he's even... Oh, he's shocked. He's shocked. I'm gonna... I'm just gonna go in for it. I'm just gonna go in for it now. And critical hit the thing. Okay, where is the Watcher? Or did the Watcher die? Oh, yeah, it did. So the Watcher died because of the explosion. That was interesting. Metal vessels and then... That container. Did that drop something? Or did I just pick that up already? Okay, that was very interesting. So the Tear Blast arrows do really, really good damage to the the Shell Walkers. And watch your heart. Thank you very much. We need to continue up there, apparently. So how do we get up there? There needs to be more stuff uh, around here. But I don't really need to be careful anymore since we killed all of them. We killed them all. We're very thorough like that. Um, I'm just going to quickly check focus every once in a while just to check if I didn't miss any enemies. Seems like there's another bridge I can make over there. And this is all four, so no biggies over there. Yeah, here we go. Creating a bridge. Anything? Ooh, there seems to be another loot box around here. Yeah. A 9% handling coil and a bit of uh, metal shards. And there's one over there as well. More supplies are always welcome. Um, we came from over there, so we need to just head further. And weirdly, mushrooms are apparently medicinal, so they can heal you if you want to. Now, how the hell do I get up there? More plants over there. Is that a machine I hear? No, it's just uh, the railing. Uh, and then the death ride we passed over because I saw that. That's what made me think I needed to uh, jump off at some point. But now, let's just climb up here. Seems like no problem at all for Aloy. Because she's uh, very athletic. And then another bridge over there. Any loot around here? Because... Ooh, just have to be careful not to jump off. Because they're not going to stop me at the edge here. And there we go. More hacking. And I think we're pretty much where we need to be. Because that seems... I said that before, but this seems like the end of the cauldron here. Nothing. No, uh... No loot for me just yet. Almost to the heart. And there's another loot box right in the middle of this hallway for some reason. Thank you. Ridgewood blades and metal shards. I can repel down. Well, why not, eh? Whee! 
don't know why she where she keeps the oh there, there, she keeps the rope right over there on her uh, on her hip there yeah it's kind of weird Ooh, 21 resist fire that is that is a worthwhile upgrade for once um resist fire weave there's more loot over there resist melee attacks weave anything else in the water i need to look for doesn't seem like it there we go more loot over here and then back inside of this wiry complex and into another big machine. Discharge pylon, energy emission tower of unknown design. May provide access to the facility's central processor. Yes. Yes, that's exactly what we need. Being able to open this is how machines are made. Woven out of light. Woven out of light. So that's a ballow back, right? For the place. That's a fire ballow back. Weakness. Frost or just breaking uh, the sack, which uh, we can't do with the tear blast arrow. So I'm gonna assume that thing is gonna go come free once we uh, repel down. This charge pylon over there and one over there. So that's probably the things that we need to check out. We can't climb those things. So yeah, here we go. Is this the floor? Looks kind of. Is this sand? That is interesting. That was a machine core medium, so we can sell that. Hello, fire bellow back. This oh yes, okay. No oh, shit. Woo! I needed to kill that. I did see that watcher. And there's one over there as well. Woo! Oh! I can't touch the shield apparently. Even though there's loot right over there. So let's just try and climb up. And take care of those uh, discharge, discharge pylons. Probably by overriding. I love her really aggressive animation when she does that. She's like really st aggressively stabbing the thing. Okay, what's going on? Oh, this thing is just dropping down. Okay, so there's something coming as well. So a few watchers. I'm just gonna take them out first and then the tear blast arrow just on top of its sack. Oh, wow. No no, you can't hit me. Yeah, underneath it, underneath its belly. Whew! This guy's, guy's aggressive, Jesus Christ. Okay, so I think... There we go, one in the back. Oh shit, need to heal, need to heal, I'm just, I'm stuck. Oh, this is interesting. Oh no, it's, it's, it's good against fire, yeah right. Um... Oh shit, I'm on fire. Okay, yes, I got it. I could stun it. Well, that does something at least. Can I do that? Oh no, I can't do that again. Um. Stunned again. Another crystal hit him. Just gonna have to go for. Oh, health gets. Health gets. There we go. I'm just gonna try and take it out with normal arrows from now on. Woo! But the bags are big enough. Oh, there's something... Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. There's something underneath it as well. I hit that, apparently. 
Are those bags just changing color or is that my focus doing that? A one of those! Lost there, lost there. Ooh, I don't want to corner myself here. Oh, that was a terrible miss. Nah. Is that it? Ooh, wow, that... That exploded. So enough damage does make it explode. Oh, yes! So that's the last bag. There's something underneath it as well. Woo! So right over there, there's something un hanging underneath there. There we go. Whew. Level 15 reach. Hell yeah. And I'm out of ammo. Just gonna make, make all the ammo I can. Because that was... That was a heavy one. Yeah, that was something. Whew. Okay. Search fire ballow back. 41 corruption coil. That is interesting. But why was this containing... Why did this have corruption? Because we didn't see any corruption. Ooh. More purple things, more corruption coils. Okay. And I think there was another one we needed to destroy, right? Wasn't there another one of those things we need to destroy? Apparently not. Just quickly gonna go around the room and loot everything. See you guys in a second. Yeah, and there we go. So now this center thingy over here. What do we need to do with this? Oh, I can override it. What is happening? This is looking really cinematic for some reason. Oh, am I overriding the core? Making this cauldron me? Mine? Mine. This will help me override them. Oh. So I got a skill point, 4,000 experience, and that got me... What can I override now? Oh, loading screen. That was interesting. Sigma overrides available. Salt, ooh, sawtooth, scrapper, grazer, and lance horn. So now I can override those. That is awesome. I do want to override the sawtooth. First core overridden. There we go. That is interesting. So this is this where we? Yeah. Okay. So this is the outside again. Wow, that was cool. Those cores are really, really powerful. Um, but yeah, with that, that's an entire episode. I'm afraid. So yeah, the fun is already over. But uh, thank you guys enormously for watching. I'm going to take a little break. Uh, and I hope to see you in the next episode where we're going to do, well, something else. I think we're just going to go... Um, I think we're going to go meet with uh, Sona again. So the Revenge of the Nora quest. And we're going to head to Red Echoes with Sona and Varl. And see uh, what we can do to uh, revenge the attack on the Nora by the Eclipse. Because I think that's what those guys are called now. So thanks again enormously for watching. And I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye.